Cause the fog on the tine is all mine, all mine The fog on the tine is all mine The fog on the tine is all mine, all mine The fog on the tine is all mine Hi guys, welcome to Geordie Hunters TV with me, Gary Sibold. Um, I saw some guys on the YouTube channels asking what sort of gear we use. Um, we use pretty much standard box, box standard gear. Um, nothing really special. Everybody can get their hands on it, what we use. Um, so I'll show you my personal setup today. And Daryl will probably do um, a video of his own personal setup. Um, however, they are quite, quite the same really. Um, so, what we'll do, I'll just pan around here. So I've got, there's my HW100, um, it's 177, it's got fitted with a, a Marksman silencer, A&M Custom Marksman silencer, and it's also fitted with an A&M Custom cylinder. Um, scopes on top, MTC Mambas, um, and that's basically it, it's 177 fitted with box standard sling and, sling and bipod. Um, with this rifle I've taken out rabbits. Up to about 61, 61 yards was probably my furthest one. Um, so it is very, very accurate rifle. Um, some of the other gear that we use. Um, we've got a, a night sight monocular. Um, 99 quid from Aldi. I think I got this one from. I've added a, a, an IR to it just to give it a little bit extra, a little bit extra, um, extra power on the IR. And basically, what I use that for is spotting. It saves the batteries on the on the lamp. Use that spot when I get within within my zero ranges. Um, switch to the lamp. I've also got my knife. Now this knife is a custom made knife, um, made of surgical surgical steel. One of the guys from uh, THL forums made that. Um, I think he still sells them, if I'm not mistaken. Got my lamp, two filters on this lamp, it came with a box standard red filter, um, but if you have a look on eBay, you can buy this, which is an IR filter, basically it's just a bit of IR perspex, um, and it converts the lamp from a red lamp to um, an extended IR for any night vision that you use, the camcorder that I'm using at the minute, has night shot fitted, so if I use that fitted to the rifle alongside that, it turns it into a, a cheap but effective night vision kit. Um, we also have our radios. These radios go anything up to six, six to ten mile. Um, very, very handy and useful in the field, especially for me and Daryl, because we we tend to split up quite a bit, um, and our permissions, the majority of them you've got no phone signal so you need some sort of comms between each other safety first if anything happens you climb on our fence or going across a gully or something and you slip and you injure yourself at least we can get in touch with each other um, to sort out any any problems that might arise um, one of the other things I use is my ghillie suit this I tend to use, well I don't use it at all on night time because there's no need for it, you don't need it. Um, but on daytime it's very effective. Um, you can get within, well the closest I've gotten with this, I didn't shoot the rabbit but I just wanted to see how effective it was in the field. I got within about 15-20 meters of the rabbit. Um, so it is really, it, it, it's well really effective. And Box standard toolbox, we just bits in that we might need. Um, pellets, spanners, screwdrivers, comfy chairs. <laughs> just it's just a basic toolkit. Um, there's no not worse than getting out in the field and something happening, and it's a problem that you can fix, but you don't have the tool to fix it. So we just carry it around, sits in the back of the car. Basically, guys, that's it. Um, like I say, there's nothing, nothing special about what kit. Um, one of the other things that I use that isn't on here is a head torch. Um, just keeps your hands free. You've, you've got a bit of light when you need it, and you can still use your hands. So that's it. Um, like I say, I think Daryl will probably do his own um, with his kit, but it's pretty much the same as what I'm using now. 
he, he uses a, a wire arc 100 hw 100 this isn't too too um well like i said that's how you do you do that for you right i'm gonna leave it at that for now cheers guys